Hi. Here is a simple deal that illustrates an important point. Let us begin by posing it as a lead problem. So this was the bidding. I did it and pass south. I was south. South was the dealer, and then east opened one note from in the fourth position. West bid two clubs taken. East showed four hearts with a two heart bid, and then West made an interesting bid. Three spade. Let me click on it. It shows balanced hand. Four card heart. Okay. I asked for an explanation. It said waste. Said it was basically giving the choice of contract to the one note from opener, and it was an artificial bid. East continued with four club, presumably a Q bid. Likely East was willing to look for a slam if waste was so inclined. But West signed off with four heart pass pass pass. What would you lead from my hand? Now notice the interesting characteristic of my hand. I got honors in red suits and three small cards in each of the black suits. Look at the artificial bids that West made. Two club and three spade. So if my partner had say two honors and five cards in any of those black suits, he would definitely have taken the opportunity to double. After all, he is likely to have something like seven eight points. I have eight points, so assuming East West have something like twenty five, partner could have seven six. Whatever he could have two honors in black suits, and if he has a five card black suit with two honors, he could double two club. He could double three spade. Similarly, if he had good cards in spade suit, so his pass rules out any of these possibilities. So, in a restricted choice sense, the pass suggests that. If I could afford to lead the remaining unbid suit, that is diamonds, I should look for that lead. I agonized over this particular decision because I had ace of diamond. Of course, there was the bidding doesn't guarantee anything. East could still have king of diamond, but it is also possible with king of diamond, East could have bid three note runs instead of four hearts. So likely that East had a surfeit of aces and kings in the suits that mattered. But obviously, uh, with king queen small of diamond or something like that, he would probably have bid opted for three no trumps. So a diamond lead suggested itself. At the same time, because I had an ace. The risk in diamond lead was pretty high. If I had king jack ten eight of diamonds, I would definitely have laid uh, from the interior sequence jack of diamonds. I will now show you all the four hands. As you can see, even if declarer Jesus clubs right, he has two definite trump losers, and on a diamond lead. We would be able to cash two diamonds, so the contract would go down on diamond lead. And note that the bidding sort of guided you to considering the diamond lead, even from that risky combination. What is the takeaway? The takeaway is that more the number of artificial bids you have, more is the likelihood. That the opening leader will arrive at a good, informed choice of his opening lead. There is much to be said for the simple sequence one note from three note. I hope you like this video. Thanks for joining. Bye.